How's it going everybody? Landon here from Curtis Outdoors and today we're going to be using bread as our bait to catch some giant fish. Now bread is one of my all time favorite baits. I've actually caught some of the biggest fish of my life on it and today we're going to take it fishing at this creek right here to see what we can catch with it. So you guys stay tuned and I hope you all enjoy. All right, so here is the creek that we're gonna be fishing at today. We don't really have a target species of fish because there's a little bit of everything that lives in this river. So I'm excited to see what we can catch. So to rig up this bread here, I think I'm just gonna take a little piece of it off just like that. And I'm gonna kind of mold it around my hook, just like that. And I think that we're good to go now. Let's see what we can catch. The water here is actually a lot higher than it usually is because we've been getting a lot of rain recently, but that's not necessarily a bad thing because I've seen some pretty big fish swim up here after a rain. All right, this looks like a pretty good spot to start fishing at. Here we go, first cast of the day. Yup, there we go. Oh my gosh, no way, we already got a fish. We're like five minutes into fishing and we already got something huge on our lines. No way. What is that? Oh, no, he's getting me wrapped around a branch here. Oh my goodness. That is big. Hey, we got a big fish on here. No way. It's like my third cast of the day. We already got something. Got light lines, so I gotta be careful with them. All right, got the net ready. I think that we got a huge carp on our lines. Yeah, I think that's what that is. Swimming right up here by me. Oh my goodness. Yeah, he's not going to be done anytime soon. That's crazy. We just started fishing. I can't even lift him up here. He's so heavy. Kind of just got to let him run. I picked up the bread too, that was instant. That's so cool right there. It's probably my biggest carp of the year by far too. Nice. I think we're getting them a little bit tired. All right, here we go. Not yet, not yet. I think the key to catching a big fish like this on light tackle is just to tire them out. I've been fighting for about, I want to say three minutes so far. Almost done. See, he's getting a little bit tired. Yeah, and we got him, look at that. No way, we actually caught that carp. Take a look at that, we actually got him. That guy put up a crazy fight. Wow, take a look at that fish right there. That is a really nice size common carp. Got him on that little piece of bread. This guy put up a crazy fight. Let's get him right back down there. That is so cool. First one of the day. And there he goes, nice. Well that was really cool. I believe that that was only my third cast of the day and we already got a really nice sized fish. Let's get it right back down there and try to catch some more now. Looks like it is starting to rain out a little bit here. We're gonna keep fishing though because it looks like it should pass. All right, so I just moved a little bit further up the creek and the current here is pretty strong so I think I'm gonna throw on a little split shot weight to keep it down there. All right, we're gonna put this weight about a foot above the bait. There we go, should be good to go now. Yup, there we go, we got a fish. We got another one, no way, look at that. There's number two of the day, oh, it's coming right at me. Looks like we got another carp on here, look at that. No way. It's been about a half an hour since I caught that last one. Finally got another. It's a little guy, but still a lot of fun to catch. Put up a huge fight. This is the thing I like about carp. No matter how big or small they are, they still put up a huge fight. Like this guy's probably about two or three pounds, fighting like crazy. Maybe he's a little bigger than that, but got him on the bread too. Working really good today. Got 
Got this guy at the exact same spot where I caught that first fish. I moved a little bit further up the river and was not able to have any more luck, so I just moved back down to where we started fishing, and we already got another fish. It's carp number two of the day. And we got him, nice. Look at that right there, that is carp number two of the day. A little bit smaller than that last one, but still a really nice looking fish. Let's get it right back down there. Say that we are having a good day of fishing so far. It's already two fish on the bread. This spot right here is probably one of the best locations to catch carp on this whole creek because there's a bunch of rapids right there and I've just been seeing a bunch of carp swim up the rapids and I just cast right in front of them. Well anyways, that just about wraps it up for today's video. I know that I had a ton of fun coming out to this creek and fishing with bread. It turned into more of a carp fishing adventure more than anything, but we were still able to catch a couple really nice sized fish. So I will see you guys in the next video.